I said before we're gonna put my we'll put the pool in. We'll put the pool down and doing this just because I don't want to have to do this more. I got the pool down and I clear up these edges a little bit. That way I don't when I when I dump my season on there, it's not gonna it's not gonna lose a bunch of it to the counter. And then I can get no kind of crazy. They're about six pounds a piece, they're twelve pounds. So I need to do that thing for about 12 hours. You gotta really, really do it light. I'll actually base this tomorrow with whiskey and uh, apple cider vinegar uh, tomorrow. Oop. Overspray. I'm just gonna give this a nice little drizzle. Same to the other side to make it wet. That way, the seasoning sticks really, really, really well. It's nice and moist, and there's, you know, I like whiskey, so there's definitely uh, going to be some hint of a whiskey flavor in there. So I want to have some pretty seasonings. So we're going to do about. I'm going to do about two and a half tablespoons of rub on the fat side. That's the least what I do. I'm just going to rub that in real nice. Get, the, get every little piece covered as much as we can. Alright. That's finished. One more time to pick the towels. And after I do this, probably going to wash my hands again. I'll have to clean everything. Ladies and gentlemen is 12 pounds of the finest brisket you ever make in your life. Guaranteed. Oh. That thing's nice, but it's really, really heavy. Uh, what I was using was this. So, after uploading it get really really grainy. I'm hoping this picture is a lot better. So if you can hear me over the dogs, uh, the camera died this morning while I was trying to get everything together for the uh, uh, the two, bris uh, two briskets. The two briskets that I'm doing. and uh, So I finally got it recharged and got, you know, emptied out the memory card and all that stuff. So I'm back to actually back outside here and the smoke is right there. Now this particular smoker is, uh, you know, one of those, probably my favorite smokers. I had to do a little bit of modification here with some electrical tape because for some reason I got caught on my shirt and I'm ripping off some of this. I don't know how that happened, but it did. And uh, let's give you, give you a shot of uh, what's going on in this smoker here. Look at that. Check that out. That is absolutely amazing. Awesome, awesome brisket. Super awesome. I'm going to have to switch these up and down. But they are looking absolutely divine. I'm going to add some chips uh, right now to it. I'm actually going to spray these with a mixture of stuff that I have. Swap them first. Gosh, money, that's amazing. Look at this thing. Tell me that ain't wonderful. It's downright edible. So that's going to be really, really good. I have a uh, special formula here. Apple cider vinegar and some uh, whiskey.
All right, so I have to fix the wife's vehicle. It's making a terrible rattling sound. Uh, I believe it's probably the heat shield on the muffler. So we're gonna get it fixed right now. Come here. Underneath the vehicle. So this is the problem right here. This clamp came loose. So I'm just gonna rip that off there. Hope you can see because I can't. Oh, my son. There it is. Got it. I know. I know I could have used a hose clamp, but I don't really feel like it. I'm just gonna use one of these. So. Golly. Oh. I don't believe there's any other pieces that are loose, so there shouldn't be no vibration. I replaced the other one with, uh, with that probably last week or so. Just a quick, just a quick fix that I had. So yeah, now I got to get out of here. <laughs> Cool. Pretty much got everything that done. Turn on this radio. But now, just gotta figure out if I got any dirt on my back. I can't see it. Baby doll. My, this is in my car. This is my car. I put my. In your car in the garage? Can I try to go get it? Everybody's got a little something in their hands. Helping out.
What? What is it? Wedding napkins, eh? That's what do you need, huh? Where'd you find those at? That bedroom closet. A whole case of them? There's some left in that box. Huh. Keep them around. Maybe we'll have a 10 year anniversary party. Break them back out. Only four more years from now. Actually, three and a half. What? <laughs> What'd you do? Nothing. Something mean and hateful? Nothing hateful and mean. Mmm. Comfy. It's done. Can't wait. Look at that. Oh. Really good. <laughs> really good. I think you've seen enough. This is a family channel. I gotta get my eat on and get this thing cut. So I got uh, smoked macaroni and cheese and smoked baked beans with whiskey in them. It's on tonight. So, I left the uh, good part out, where I actually ate, um, I was elbows deep in that mess, so, <clears throat> had to do some work on that, it was, it was good, so I'm sorry I left you out on that part, but it turned out really, really good, I was cleaning up here, I got the uh, cord and my gloves, getting ready to head in the house here, and uh, relax for the rest of the night. A little worn out from being up at five o'clock in the morning doing this, but man, it was a it was a good time. Had a lot of fun. Ate really really good, and uh, I'd love to do it again tomorrow, but I'm pretty tired and my belly is full. I'm glad you guys could join me on the little ride here for today for the uh, brisket. Hope you had a good time. Don't forget to thumbs up, subscribe. Almost Outdoors. Thanks for watching. See ya!